Right, so we're going to start off. We want the bit of pipe, so we've got a conjure box to go on here, well, a skeleton box, and we want the bend to be 40 mil from the back of here. So what we're going to do is we're going to put a measurement out. We're going to put a measurement on here first. And if I scratch it, you should be able to see it better. In this light, actually the pencil might. So this is the back of the bend. So what we're going to have to do is we set off here. You go 60 mil towards the back. So what we're doing is it's three times the bend radio of the pipe. Now when we line up this. There is a line here, which is where the bend should start, but that should be so when we've got the bender lined up with this and it's 90 degrees up, that is where our bend is going to fall. So this will be the back, this mark here will be the back of the bend, and this will be the start of the bend. So if you bend that round. slightly over so we got the back of the bend there so if I put that in like this and we measure we have 40 mil on the back of the bend and that is how to do that so all you've got to do is remember that when you are bending and it's the rever reverse side of the bend, so this is the back of your bend, to come back 60 mil. See, so the original mark that we had was there, and there's our mark there. So that was our original mark, so we came back 60 mil because that was going to be the back of the bend. If we'd have come through and then we were measuring it out the other way, we would have just brought the line to there, that would have been our bend, and that would have been the back of the bend. So I hope that helps. Please like, share and subscribe. Now turn up